Shalom Israel. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim, Raka Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone, and peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the prophets, the hopeful elect, the 144,000, and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Back with another lesson. Um, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, I was going to title this. Uh, uh, then shall they know who my chosen is. Then shall they know who my chosen is. You know, I want to uh, go right into uh, this article I was reading today. And it's talking about Beijing over there in that China. And it says Beijing kicks off mass testing after spike in COVID cases. You see, <laughs> we're, we're coming into a time. It's the playtime is over. You see, Yahweh by Shimia was shy. Is, is he ultimately is about to bring forth the hammer. See, those people over there in that Beijing over there in, um, over there in China, they said, you know, 29 million people are on lockdown. 29 million. I'm going to get, I'm going to get into the article though. But it says, <laughs> it says the Chinese capital Beijing has ki has kicked off mass testing for millions of residents after a spike in COVID cases. The ch the ch Chai Chaiyang. District reported 26 cases over the weekend, the highest number so far in Beijing's latest surge. It says long outside supermarkets and shops were seen despite government assurance there is sufficient food. It comes aimed fears that Beijing could face a similar situation to Shanghai, Shanghai, Salakia, over there in Shanghai, all those millions of people locked down, which has seen some 25 million people shut in their homes for weeks. See, I want to get a quick, quick scripture. Let me get a quick scripture. It says, um, we'll go to uh, Ezekiel 2 and 7. Ezekiel 2 and 7, and it reads, And thou shalt speak my words unto them. Uh, who? Unto Israel. Whether they hear, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear. For they are most rebellious. And see, and starting with the apostles and elders and the prophets on down at Great Millstone, we've been warning you day and night, you know, telling you on what's coming, the famine, you know, the pestilence, you know, uh, um, the martial law. This is all coming. To a city near you. Let's go back into the article. Because Israel don't want to listen. He, he, the Lord just told you. They are most rebellious people. You so called Negroes. Latinos and Native American Indians. You, you, two thirds of you. You mock and scorn. And laugh. You're not serious. It's too much playing. Y'all going to learn though. Because this is coming. It says, I'm 
to lock you. It says the news prompt residents to rush to stock up essential supplies with images circulating on local, on local media showing supermarket shelves empty of goods and, and snacking at checkout counters. And, and, and that's ultimately too, that's, that's what's going to happen when they start to, uh, 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 you know, uh, to let you know uh, about a lockdown or uh, uh, when it starts to, you know, uh, cook up, especially here in Babylon, because this is coming here to Babylon. You know, when they start to, when they start to hear it and hear it, they're going to rush to the supermarkets, man. And it's already a famine brewing. It says super, supermarket shelves emptied of goods and snacking. See, and this is why, you know, it's okay to go get you a, uh, so a little, you know, some food and, you know, try to put you something away, but that ain't ultimately, that's not going to save you, man. That's not going to save you because this next round, when this comes, when this happens, oh, they, they going to kick up dust here in Babylon. They going to, they going to tear it down because they, they ain't going for it. It says Beijing major supermarkets also extended their opening hours to accommodate the spike in demand. It says, never, never thought I would go to the market early in the morning. When I got there, all the eggs and prawns were gone and all the meat was snatched up. And you see, and they're already talking about uh, as far as the eggs here in Babylon, that it's what, like 30 million uh, birds that they didn't already kill, the chickens, the turkeys, you know, they didn't already kill them. So it's about to be a major shortage here uh, with these eggs and, and, and oil too that's coming. You know, oil is a luxury, uh, uh, a luxury to have, oil and wine. And it tells you that in, uh, what is that? Uh, is that Isaiah 24? You know, the grinding cease, the, the grinding gets low. You know, all that's coming, man. The, the, the jobs being shut off, people losing, they, they work and, 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 uh, uh, the music turned down low and that Isaiah 24 quote me if I'm wrong. In the meat, they, they, you know, they're talking about that. Uh, uh, it's a disease going on with the birds. So the, the the shortage of chicken, all this is about to hit the fan real soon here. We're days away, days. And then it says, it says, um, some in lockdown areas of Shanghai say they have been struggling to access food supplies and forced to wait for government drop-offs of vegetables, meat, and eggs. Green barricades have also been erected overnight in parts of Shanghai without prior warning, effectively preventing residents from leaving their homes. And this is what's coming here. This is what's coming to Babylon, man. You <laughs> and some of these apartment places, especially in the in the in that Jake area, they gonna they gonna barricade a lot of these places, man. You will not be able to leave. It says some of the measures Chinese authorities have enforced include placing electronic door alarms to prevent those infected from leaving and forcibly evacuating people from their homes to carry out disinfection uh, procedures. This is all, this is, this, we're coming into the time of Jacob's trouble, man. See? Let me go to uh um let me go to Jeremiah. 
Let me go to Jeremiah 7 and 20. I'll start at 25. And it reads, Since the day that your fathers came forth out of the land of Egypt unto this day, I have even sent unto you all my servants, the prophets. Let me read that again. Je Jeremiah 7 and, 7 and 25. Since the day that your fathers came forth out of the land of Egypt unto this day. What? This day. Unto this day. I have even sent unto you all my servants, the prophets. It ain't stopped. It ain't stopped. All the Lord's servants, John the Baptist, you know, Daniel, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Matthew, Peter, Paul, James, you know, it, 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 it ain't stopped. All the Lord's servants all through this time and, and, and Israel has continued to be rebellious. That's why you're in captivity, getting your brains beat in. You see, getting your, your brains beat in, getting beat down. But there's a time that we're coming into, into Jacob's trouble where the Lord is going to put, he, he going to put a whooping on you so cold, Israel, two thirds of you. Daily rising up early and sending them. You know, all the way back then to Noah and, you know, uh, 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 all the way until now to, high, uh, uh, to um, uh, Abba Bivens and High Priest Arya and Marsha and uh, um, um, uh, 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 Apostle Tahar, uh, uh, Gabar, Apostle Gabar and uh, uh, Ramlad. And uh, Raka, you know, to the elder Malcolm and uh, uh, the elders on down, you know, uh, the list goes on all the way into this day. All the way into this day, the Lord is sent. He's still sending his prophets. And they've and they've and, and been warning you. Day and night about what's coming. 26. Yet they hearken not unto me. You don't want to listen. You got you you still got Jake out here, you know, Babylon out. You know, they see the, they see the prophets online on the highways and hedges, mocking them, you know, not listening thinking that they, they got it all figured out. You got Jake trying to come together and build some type of a, 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 a business here and, 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 and got thinking that they're going to build some type of army and getting all the guns and, you know, to get, trying to get all the money and establish yourself here. It ain't going to work. And, and, and the, pro, the starting with the apostles, been warning you. But you don't listen. Yet they hearken not unto me, nor incline their ear, but harden their neck. And see, and that's what Jake do. You try to tell them about the destruction that's coming. They they don't want to hear it. You get called a, a, a false prophet and, you know, uh, uh, you ain't no Hebrew Israelite. And, you know, the Lord loves everybody and you're going off and the, the list goes on. They harden their neck. They don't want to hear it. They did worse than their fathers. You two third Jakes have you did worse than your fathers. At least the, the, our forefathers knew, you know, Yahweh. They knew the name Yahweh Shemuel Shai. They knew. They knew it. Today, you don't. You 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 just discredit yourself away from your heritage and trying to do. Thus said the Lord. 
You lean on your own understanding and you go, you, you two third J's go in your own vain opinion. You don't want to open this Bible and read it for yourself and try to uh, 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 get some understanding. You don't want to do it. You like being here in Babylon and trying to get your bag and smoke your weed and party it up and establish yourself and have a business and, and, and you know, and, and have pride and, you know, uh, and be tough. Thinking that you know it all. Want to be on TV and be famous? 27. Therefore, that, therefore thou shalt speak all these words unto them, but they will not hearken unto them. They will not hearken to thee. Thou shalt also call unto them, but they will not answer thee. You see? You see? But they won't hearken. But the Lord says, still, you go ahead and tell them still. You warn them. You tell them. So let's go to, uh, uh, I'm going to close out. What is this? I So this is what's coming. We're going to go to Isaiah 10 and um, we'll go to Isaiah 10 and 5. I'll close out with this because you Jake's going to learn, man. You, you two third Jake's, you're going to learn. You got this famine coming. You got this war coming. You got uh, 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 that karagma coming, that CHIP coming. You got all these things that the Lord is about to bring within, with, within, you know, we're days away from this stuff happening. That Jacob's trouble is at the door. I just read to you what they're doing over there in that Be Beijing and Shanghai. This is coming here. The Lord said he was going to come in like a thief in the night, man. And a lot of you Jakes just ain't ready. You ain't ready. But the Lord told you these things to watch, to pray, watch, and fast. And if you have your spiritual eyes on, you see it's about to come. You see it's about to come. It's all about to hit the fan within these next you know, it could be 60 days. It's all going to hit the fan. You know, with the with the fat, with the famine, you know, with the food being real scarcely, you know, uh, 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 another, you know, them talking about the uh, uh, C-19, you know, emerging or a new uh, 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 strain, you know, something that uh, you we could be looking at another lockdown or something. You can see this coming within the next 60 days. Here we go by July, somewhere around there, I think, through the spirit. And then here come that flood. So this is what the Lord is going to do to you, to you two-third Jakes. It says, Isaiah 10 and 5, O Assyrian the rod of mine anger. Who's the Assyrians? It's Esau in this time. See, he used the Assyrians last time in Isaiah time. But this time, it's still to this day, like he said, the Assyrians is Esau because they're in rulership. The rod of mine anger and the staff in their hand is mine indignation. You see, Esau has, he has these, Esau has the, the Lord, Yahweh Shem Shai has, has given, uh, through the power in the spirit of letting Esau create these devices and these weapons that you Jakes cannot, you, you can't even comprehend 
the uh, devices and the technology that you're going to face in this time when they sin against you. You think that your guns are going to, your guns aren't going to save you. It's not going to work. These devices and the technology that Esau Edom has that the Lord is uh, uh, through the power and the spirit, let Esau and them create. This is the Lord's left hand. You can't battle the Lord. This is why you have to come back to him. But what did the Lord say? They won't listen. So the Lord's going to, he's going to let, he's going to let these Assyrians, AKA Esau, eat them, you know, come in like a flood and they're going to take you to, they're going to take two thirds of you Jake's out. Even, uh, uh, um, well, the elect is going, you know, some of the elect is going to have to, uh, they'll be thrown in, in prison, you know, uh, tortured or, you know, killed for this word. And some are going to, you know, they're going to make, you know, make it all the way through and have spirit and, have, and, and, and get spiritual power in this time. Because this is what it's going to take to, 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 to go up against this man and his devices. It's going to take spiritual. It's going to take Yahweh by Shimei Awashai to do this, man. To, to get to give his men spiritual powers to where they try to shoot you or try to grab you up or, you know, he, he's going to, you know, however they do it, the, the Lord, Yahweh by Shimei Awashai is going to, he is going to take him with their, because with, Esau got that uh, AI technology, these robots, these androids, these drones, you you can't uh, flesh can't beat this man. You can't beat it. All these you know people trying to stock up on on uh, uh, guns and ammo and stuff. That's not gonna work. You're not gonna beat Esau like that, man. Because a lot of his technology is outer space. You know, uh, you got those uh, uh, what is that? Those shock waves or uh, I can't even really. You know, I just know it's, <laughs> it's beyond, you know, our comprehension, the technology that he got. It's, and a lot of that stuff, we can't even see it. You know, you it takes it's going to take the Lord to do this, to defeat Esau, like he said. But the Lord is going to he's going to send Esau and to take all you wicked Jake's. So you can stock up as much as guns and stuff and you think that you're going to be able to defeat and, and be ready to fight in this time. It ain't going to happen. You, some of Jake going, going to get down and, and tear tear this place up. But at the end of the day, Esau is going, it, until the Lord raises up a standard and he comes back, that's the only way Esau is going to get knocked off. But a lot of Esau, going, they, they, yeah, they're going to get it too. Jake going to get with Esau, some of them. It's just going to be, it's just going to be chaos. But at the end of the day, it's going to take Yahweh by Shai to raise up a standard and, and give his men spiritual power. And for him and them angels, the Allahayim to come back and to completely knock off Esau and take him out. But in the meantime, he's sending these Assyrians against you two third Jake's. Six, I will send him against an hypocritical, a hypocritical nation and against the people of my wrath will I give him a charge. You see, and uh, uh, Israel is a hypocritical nation. Just like you claim, you know, uh, 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 you let those, you know, them, them police knock, they knocking and gunning down Jake, but here you got Jake gunning down each other. The minute uh, a, a police officer, you know, a, a, a police officer stopped Jake, J you know, and Jake don't want to cooperate. Jake don't want to cooperate. Does that give a reason to, to uh, uh, for the police officer, for Esau and them to gun him down? No, but Jake gets out of line instead of just, you know, uh, resisting, following through and, and just getting over it and getting through you. you it, Jake likes to go through the uh, drastic measures. Want to get a police attitude and act stupid. Don't want to uh, show your license. Got something smart to say. 
You know, you're not, you're in no position to do that. And then want to end up trying to run or go on a high speed chase. And then it, that's when the Lord, you know, <laughs> you know, he, he, he gives him over into that Assyrian to Edom. Esau, Esau takes you out. Hypocrites. Hmm? You want to talk about the police gunning everybody down, but Jake steady gunning each other down. To take the spoil and to take the prey and tread them down like the mire of the street streets. Call Halal Yahweh by Shemyawa Shai. You know, these are the things that's coming, man. You know, this Jacob's trouble is going to be serious uh, way beyond what we can think of, man. You know, they, they, the, the sedition amongst men, the chaos. Esau is going to send in this military and his, uh, 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 you know, everything that he got on Jake. And that over there in that Shanghai and Beijing that's a preview on what's coming. They set an alarm doors to where, you know, it goes off if you're infected and you come out. They going inside people's home, taking them out. This is all coming. Joe Biden already, he said this right when he got elected. You know, uh, 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 what is that? That, um, uh, what are those, um, for, task units, task units. You know, that's still out there. He got spies out there. He been Esau ain't went nowhere. When Joe Biden came in here, all, through all this time, through all that pandemic, Esau has been watching and keeping notes on what's going on. He's been watching. Hmm? You know, they got these detention centers set up. Esau has everything already laid out. It's just his timing that he, when he's ready to go, he gonna, it's, he gonna, it's gonna happen. And this is ultimately through Yahweh Shemal Shai. Yahweh Shemal Shai, through the spirit, it looked like he just, he, it's about almost time to let it go. Because the signs are all here. The famine is here. The war is there. It, the war is about to just. It's, it's like the 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 pot is. You got the pot on high, and the water is just popping out the dang uh, 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 pot. It's it's boiling. It's about to fall off the dang stove. That's where we at right now. So, you know. Prophecy continues to keep moving forward and the elect is going to make it through this. The Lord is going to put the uh, spirit on the elect to, uh, to, to withstand this all. And he's going to raise up a standard in this time to give his men spiritual power. And they go and they go and, you know, they're going to get it on, man. The elect will be taken care of. But you two thirds of you Jakes of Israel denying your heritage, mocking and scorning the men of the Lord, you know, uh, 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 saying F uh, the God of uh, Israel and, you know, talking all crazy. This is for you. The Lord is about to send Esau against you. These Assyrians and they're going to put a whooping on you. So, but through the spirit, you know, uh, spirit hopped on me. I wanted to go in on that. But I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Raka Kwadash. Shalom, Israel. Hopefully, you're edified. I don't want to come back with another lesson. Shalom, Israel. Call Allah, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai.